how to knit binding off in pattern. For this tutorial, you will need a set of knitting needles and a ball of yarn. Step 1. Knit your first stitch as normal. Then, depending on what your next stitch is, you're going to knit or purl that stitch uh, the way that, that it is. So you're going to be following the pattern. So on here we have a one by one rib. So we knit one and then purl one. So for this one, I'll bring the yarn in front and purl one. Let's say you had like a two by two rib where it was knit, knit, purl, purl. Then you would knit the second stitch and purl the stitches that were purled. So we'll bring the yarn in back for step three. You're going to slip the first stitch over the second stitch. Okay, just like that. All right, step four, we're going to knit one. Step five, slip the first stitch over the second stitch. Step six, purl one. And bring the yarn in the back. Step seven, slip the second stitch over the first stitch. Okay, so we'll continue repeating steps four through seven. Uh, and you're going to be knitting or purling based on what stitches done the row before. And then you'll do that until you have one stitch left on your needle. When you have one stitch left on your needle, you're going to want to break or cut your yarn. And then you're just going to pull that stitch right through the hole and tighten it down. Here's an example of binding off in pattern on a one by one rib stitch swatch. Did you know there are six standard weights of yarn? Superfine, fine, light, medium, bulky, and super bulky. For more videos, visit www.newstitchaday.com.